Each of the following graphs represents a potential path Naomi can take from home to school. Determine if each graph represents a possible or impossible motion. In the animation, we can see things start out fine, with Naomi going to school at a constant speed. The problem occurs when the graph backs up on itself. Well, you may be thinking this means Naomi just heads backwards, it doesn't. It would mean time itself heads backwards, and that's impossible. It's actually pretty easy to determine if a path is possible. Just use the vertical line test. If a vertical line passes through more than one point, the motion is impossible. Now we'll investigate graph B. The animation shows Naomi accelerate to the midway point between home and school. She then decelerates as she completes the second half of the motion. This motion is possible. Now we'll look at the graph in part C. In the animation, everything is fine until the graph hits the vertical region. The vertical region means that Naomi occupies more than one position at the exact same time, which is impossible. 